Hey guys, this is Griffin with Waste on Furniture. Today we're going to be building the hollow core TV stand. This is our rustic oak finish and you can find it at your local Walmart or on walmart.com. Uh, before we start, you want to check all of your pieces, make sure that they're all there and that there's no damage done to them while shipping. And you want to also check that you have all your hardware. Uh, if you have any issues, you can call this number on the front of the manual and we'll get you taken care of. And if everything's good, we can be ready to assemble. For step one, you're going to want to get four cam bolts, eight cam locks, and 16 wood dowel pieces. And then you can start by putting these wood dowels into the ends, leaving about three quarters of an inch uh, out. Next, you're going to want to put your cam locks into the slits right here and you want these plus and minus on it to be facing out away from the panel. And then you're going to want to put them into these holes right here and you're going to have to push the cam locks all the way into uh, the holes and it's easier if you use a screwdriver for this. and make sure that those plus and minuses are facing this way. And then you will want to screw these cam bolts into these outer two holes. Okay, so for step two, you're gonna want eight cam bolts four Waddell pieces and four cam bolts, or cam locks. So you would want to put it into the, these cam locks into the E panel. And then the four Waddell pieces on the edges. And then screw in these cam bolts onto the outer uh, holes. Okay, so for step three, you're going to want to take your two D pieces and your E panel and then set up your E panel like this. And then whenever you're doing this, make sure that the cam locks for this piece and the other side are pointed in the same direction. And then to tighten these, you just turn it clockwise. Okay, so for step four, you're going to want to have your big A panel and two B panels. And then you're going to insert them into the cam locks. And for the B panels, you're going to make it so that the cam locks are on the inside. Okay, so for step five, you're going to want to have your C panel and your eight screws.
For step six, you'll place each of the foot pads on each foot, and then step seven, screw them in. Then you want to set it up to get the bottom two. Thank you.